You can hello everyone. This is Nancy. Happy what today is Tuesday. Time flies so fast and I can't wait to see everyone today again today and that's gonna be a fun live tutorial again. Hi LA woman, how are you? Let me type it in quick. Hey Cece, I'm gonna have you, hi Maya. I'm gonna type in the website right there, pin there. Thank you everyone for tuning in. And then this is This is the nails that we did last night. And we did it with the Snick Skin, Chan for Foy, and Ombre. Plus, we did the crystal placements on it. So today we are going to do it. Continue with three more designs from the Snick Skins. Uh, Foy is really much fun with this. And this color is a black and white, yellows, and pink is really interesting so i'm gonna do it three more nails today and tomorrow's gonna have so much fun to do with a lot of new products gonna dropping for uh tomorrow hey eric's hi camilla hello mama vic thank you so much for uh tuning in just a website Hope everyone have a great Tuesday. Call by Ali. Thank you, Ali. Hey, Debbie. I just want to say hello to everyone. All right, so let's get started with... Um, let me see. What do you need? All right. So let's go into the first nails right here. And I am going to have three nails. I'm gonna move this, but if you are missing this live video, don't worry, you can watching them on our IGTV. And it's gonna be available on our IGTV as well as on Facebook and YouTube channels. So thank you so much for everyone tuning in. So let's move on to this three nails that we are going to do. I have a little bit of the foils is sticking here, but do not worry about it because we're gonna do some chanfer foil on this one. I'm using chanfer foil gel premiums, and I am going to apply it on the top of the nails. I'm gonna do whole nails because I might I might apply all the nails I guess. And here for thirty seconds. So I'm going to do the same thing with the other one, the pink one. And I'm going to do is the same for 30 seconds. going to use really like it I really want to do you don't have to do straight you can't let do it right diagnose and then chain what am I choosing I'm not using that one
everything that came out. Just that part missing right there. It's really cool. It's completely in chamfer. And I'm gonna do this next one. accidentally that I think I but it's not gonna mix it's gonna chamfer completely Make sure you're using a presser. I have a little bit of oil on my hands. Oops, sorry, I hit the Facebook camera. Look at the crease. And then the last ones, we are going to use some fusionings on it. But I really want to do fusioning on it, but then also I really like this effect. So should I do some fusioning and do half of the nails? Or should I, because I'm debating. Hello, Grace. How are you? Let me give it one second. So we can't go it. All right. Okay, so both. All right, flying all over. Okay, so then this one, I'm gonna do fusion in. And then we can do all crystal placement together. I'm going to using obsidian. Make sure you shake it really well. Hi, adorable, how are you? I think we need another one. station and grab another brush it's okay I'm trying to doing it fusioning but I don't have an obsidian right in front of me so I want to do chanfer foil and we're gonna dress this one up for 30 seconds make sure you optimize all the gels or else it's gonna miss uh, 30 seconds please need to be off no I don't need that one anymore Was that one? Okay, that one. Thank you. All right, in the meantime, we are going to um, apply again. This is so cool though. It's really interesting with the snake skin.
it's really fun. All of them came up. So I'm really curious and then interesting about how with the skins, the snake skins, all really pretty. I really want to try some of the weaver gels on it, but I don't think I need it because it looks really cute. I don't want to destroy that though. It's really different. So I'm going to do some crystal placement because I'm seeing what I can do when playing with this so then I can show you. Condensed blue gel. I'm gonna put some crystal on. I have totally of different preparations and then it's come out different. So it's okay, I'm still really enjoying it. But in the meantime, you can see that how cool is that. So let me go in with this. I have totally a different plans for all of you, but this turned out so beautiful. I never care much for a snake because I really scare. But it looks so cute. All right, hold on. Let me move this one. All right, so now next we're gonna using a no wipe top coat first on the top of Unkeer Condensed Glue Gels. Very interesting. I love it. It looks so pretty. So I did instead of straight on the um the image, the snake skin, I did it a little bit diagonal so that it give it looks really cool. Look. You can do it straight however you prefer. I think it's gonna be so cool and stunning. Let me use one of this. Doesn't matter. Maybe right there. It is really fun and super easy, simple uh, for beginners or for all of you who've been doing um, nails for a long time and looking for something is new. I'm using is a uh, yellow banana, I believe. Is that right? Right yellow? I got it wrong. I'm gonna check the. So if you're first time doing it and you're not sure if you can able to place a crystal, it's really simple. I'm gonna share you something. Um, as long as you get a big centerpiece, doesn't matter smaller, big, centerpiece. I'm gonna use obsidian on this one. Um, can we get the obsidian, my obsidian beads? No, obsidian beads. Okay. And you do the big piece, centerpiece, and then you using your um, different colors of the theme that you want to. You can do it like, this one is so cute. I You can do it obsidians um, crystal, or you can do obsidians or yellow crystals, either way, however you prefer. Hope everyone have a great Tuesday. Thank you so much for tuning in. It's really cool and interesting because I have whole entire different plan, but you know what? It turned out so cool. I'm not gonna lie to you. I said, ooh. It turned out way um, better than I expecting because I thought this, you know, is not going to turn out. But even by itself, looks really cool. And my continued dress is really cool right here. Maybe that.
and so okay so here's a really cool tip and trick so if you're doing this uh, crystal placement you get the big centerpiece or however centerpiece you would like to and you using the crystal working along with that I'm gonna use a, the beads and the frame. Is this on the shape that I'm using a little mini um, oval? And that is come in with the Christmas in July special kits, special promotion. I should do my obsidian, but then I have my frame. It's so cute on that look. And then if you're doing with the clients, you can like have beats on, or if the clients don't want any beats on, you can absolutely do it without having additional beats on it, like a metal beats. Some clients love the look of it like jewelry. Some it just wants get some designs on. So one more look today for this next skin because there are ten different color of the snake skins I think and I just want you to not missing it tomorrow's gonna have a totally of so another awesome content I can't wait I'm gonna show you just a little bit just bear with me I might hit the So I'm using a little bit of the bars from the frames and um, silver and gold frames, metal art. You can feel this spot here, but you don't. If you don't want to, you absolutely don't have to. Oh, oh I know why. It's... Looks great. Let's keep it space like that. And I'm happy with this and I want to so basically it's really concept you get in the big centerpiece smaller centerpiece whatever you want to be you can do it diagonal you can do right in the centers where is your cuticle is and then you can walk around and have add additional of different crystal stones or you can do is like any colors you can do AB you can do colors and you walk around with this so give it a really is fun look of design and you can add on different shape as well all right, so we're gonna give this one for 60 seconds. I didn't want to go further because, you know, I, you know me, I'm gonna cover the whole and tie this next skin, so then it's not gonna be fun because I want to, to see the effects of it. All right, so let's give this for 60 seconds. Oh, thank you, Eric. Hi, live rats. How are you, love? Thanks so much for tuning in. All right. Here you go. Just be careful. I have whole entire totally a different plans for this, but then when I get the later foil on, it's so beautiful by itself. Like basically by itself. It's just amazing. 
so I'm gonna do this next one condensed blue gels again this is a first step of trifecta to keep the crystal stay nice in a nice place really thin if your first time using it just make sure you blend it really nice and do not afraid of to like I pick some of them but it's not enough a little bit of um, portion but it's not enough then you can go back and add more make sure you get it enough give it a couple of time to try it if you're too thick then you maybe need a little bit less but if you're too thin you probably need a little bit more because you don't want it too thin that it's not gonna hold your crystal also you don't want to be too thick it's gonna flood your crystal so we just have to be in like um, balance and a no wipe top coat on the top of Ankia condensed glue gels and let's move this color to yellow move and then we're gonna using Bahamas no Ruby Rose I'm sorry Oh, thanks so much, Zoe. Thank you, Sinflower. Thanks so much, everyone, for tuning in. All right, so let's move on to that one. And I am going to do this triangle. And you don't have to do right in the middle. You can, don't have to do right in the center. You can do right in the middle. Absolutely. I am going to frame some of this along together. You don't have to, you can just like come up with something cool. I just see in this frame, this looks cool and I can't help it. So you're gonna try some, I will try to find some frame. And this is, I'm using a frame collection from um, from our Christmas in July kit. If you haven't seen that, I will show in a little bit. It's so interesting. And we are working on that different design. We have some new idea with this. With this mother. I can't wait for tomorrow as well. Tomorrow content's gonna be so exciting so you like you can finish it like this but to me I feel like it's a little bit missing something I add beads on however oh, 
using it. Careful and good. Sorry if I move my hand. Did I move it too far? So usually when I do it, I like to finish the end. It looks a little bit so like more like a pointed end, like a tail, instead of just finish it and like, like basically I cut it off. But I always want to get a nice smooth um, finish. Looks, I try not to cover a lot because I love Bristol and I love this. Like, okay, so I don't care much for snake. But this design, this especially with um, designs on that, it looks so pretty. Who's ever like, do we really have the pink snake? Or we're we just doing it for fun as a nail art? Then, okay, so pink snake, then I'm okay with this. But snake is so scared though. I know how friendly it is, but all right. So we're gonna give this one for sixty seconds. Just one more. Okay, it's done. Okay, still a bit beat or whatever it is. All right. Uh, let me see if I have my flashlight. So if you are with the clients and you're afraid of, okay, here's some cool tip and trick I'm gonna share with you now. So when the clients get it done and if they have to move and especially with the clients like moving a lot with their hand. So the best way if you want to flash gear them, just have one of your black lights with you and just gear quick, maybe about a few seconds right there, like holding her hand and I'm doing it right now. So it's kind of help to flash gear it. So then it's not moving in out now and you put her hands in under the LED lights. So that's why you won't have to worry about she moving like all of the stones, especially if you're doing a 3D crystals, you can using a flashlight. I mean the black light to just key it really quick. Flash key and then you can have the clients to put it on um, LED lights. Because sometimes a ship, if they not pay attention, they teal their hands, then it just move your crystal that you've just been working so hard to put it on. Here's a first look. It's really stunning. It was very nice. And I am going to move to the last one, which is a black and white, something stick on it, maybe the gels or whatever. This one is interesting. Looks so cool. Oh, you're very welcome, Zoe. So hope it helped because you can just flash gear for a few seconds and it will really help because then it's help not to ship all that um, your crystals. So I'm gonna using uh, condensed glue gels and the next gonna be of no wipe top coat on the top of this unclear condensed glue gel. I'm applying enough amount of, like I have extra right here. I'm gonna wipe it, put it back into the pot, close, the leads on because you don't want it to be clear under LED lamp. And then let's see with this one we're gonna using some red colors here and maybe obsidian I guess. No wipe top coat on the top. I 
I meant to do like a whole entire cool fancy thing with all snake skin and then it turned out that I have a really cute one also. It's really stunning though. I really enjoying it. Wait until you see me doing snake skin and a lot of different newest color of weaver gels and it'll be like wow, it's stunning. So so many different cool idea with this. Doesn't matter. I can put the heart on this one. I do not care. Snake can have fancy. Oh, it's no frame. We can do a frame as well, but look at that. Snake heart, maybe. I don't know how to use. super cute. We wear it all the time. It doesn't have to be in the Valentine. I have a tiny little one, huh? Do I have a bigger size on it? More? Like a smaller size, I guess. I do it right in the middle. It doesn't have to be. So should I do a go on this one? Goes will send out, right? You think? Let me see if I can protect this heart. And if you do this, your crystal will not go anywhere. I'm so pleased with this. It's just stay on. Hey, thank you so much. Hey, Foxy, thanks so much seeing flowers. I think so, you think? That's why I said it's so cool. I'm gonna try, give it a try and see how it's gonna turn out. I have whole entire different plans for this design. But when I seen this appliance on, I said, oh my God, it's so pretty. And sometimes thing is changing a little bit different for your plans. Then, hey, I'm okay with this. Just go with the flows. That's why it turned out it's really nice. You know what? I have to be honest with you that every single time, if I'm not saying it, if I, as I remember, every single time I prepare for you, it doesn't turn out good. I like either drop my stuff or my brush is going one direction. And it's a crazy thing. You can't imagine it. Like, so, but if the day I still prepare for you and it doesn't go the way I want it and I just go with the flows, just go with what the best. Hey, Chantella, sorry, I missed it. Hey, Tony, if you're there, sorry, my phone, it was dying on the other phone. I couldn't view it on Facebook, but of course now it's crashed. So I appreciate every single of you. You know that this is video is for you from a love and for appreciation from all of us. So I'm grateful for every single of you. If you have some minute to just tuning in. Hello, Foxy, if you are there. I just saw when I turned uh, my head on my phone, I saw you uh, just came in or well, maybe before I didn't get to see it. So, but you know, doesn't matter I prepare or I'm not like I prepare for one way and it's not different way I take it no complaint at all and just go with this and really appreciate and grateful for even I can be here to stream for every single of you I know like sometimes it's not being unhelpful because if you're looking for something that is not here let us know we can absolutely doing a tutorial for that also we have like I think on our IGTV over 100 different 100 videos now. 
but on our YouTube and Facebook we probably have over 200 um, video to support you this is all the footage for you that if you need something or you feel like you are not confident of this like the same with me I'm just like everyone else and I always have to go back to my video and watch it again to just like remind me of my okay we can do that simple or we can do that difficult or complicated so I'm gonna wipe this off just a second so then it keeps a nice shape of the nails so now if you look at this if you have the shorter nails you can absolutely move right in here in the cuticles I just give a room so then either you have a shorter nails or long nails you can really rock this design great okay so now I'm gonna go and cure this for 60 seconds so with this if you like um, sometimes we have like the videos that you probably particularly don't looking for it now but there are a lot of different tutorial videos or back then you can view it on our IGTV so those footage will help support you so much and we continue with the newest products and in trendy so you can be proud of to be ahead of the game with everybody else and proud of with your clients that you are not behind great awesome here for 60 seconds I'm really enjoying it today even like it's a snake skin you know it's funny is that how we look at this um, and I say hey it's a snake skin it's kind of scared to doing it my sister have a big one my sister have a huge and I don't know if he's still, he's still surviving now I think he might I'm gonna, put, I'm gonna do um precision glue gel I can't wait today I'm so excited you don't know how hard it is because I barely can wait because I'm gonna show you something it's very really cool and we're gonna do it tomorrow I'm like all over places it's, oh my god I want this I want to do this but we can't do that as the plans are we gonna do it tomorrow I have to be patient so okay so let's do precision glue this is the last step of um, our crystal placement concept and this is like usually normally you are done you know, be honest, back many years ago, like almost 20 years ago when I started doing nails after my college and maybe one of this, I still keep some of my pictures to remind and to just remind me of where I'm come from and I'm always trying to learning and inspired by a lot of you and I couldn't even pull like doing crystal placement like this. I was so nervous I did some and then I got picture for clients and then basically the next day the crystal was coming off right and then I'm so afraid of to really like chalks or chalks at higher or to the right I mean I don't say a higher I will say chalk accordingly with the products and your techniques because even though I still like really trying to learning but it's still not a limited of what we can learn and the techniques and the products back then so I'm really like probably some of the pictures look the picture but I don't know it's like it's not last long so I'm feeling it with the needles I'm feeling all the cracks and the gaps and the edges of crystals for all of you who just first time tuning in thanks so much for tuning in with our live tutorial so here this one for 60 seconds I am moving and um, earlier I using this to just blend out all that residues which is um, the excess precision glue this is tag free so then you can won't have to worry about like have to um, top coat it again and also you can if you're using frame you can absolutely fill on the top of this frame so it keep it prevent from tarnage I love that how is one of the advice forms uh, also from live rash one time and then Debbie will say Nancy top coat I forgot so see so I'm so live because of all views for the love and support um, so now I don't feel really like um, worry about 
crystal placements anymore because it's such a great system that I really happy and grateful for it or else I would never feel like it's confidence as much as now when I do crystal placements so I come a long way and out of my fears doing all the stuff that I think I couldn't able to achieve you know but I am here today with all of you and learning like everybody else I've learned so much from all of you I learn every day so it's not you don't see me on social media every day it's just only a live stream but i learn all day long even in my dream too in my, in my sleep so we're gonna kill this one for 60 seconds so okay so here's my in my sleep so sometime when i get really really exhausted or tired i pass out when things but if i'm still like my brain is still working like i will sleep for a few hours and i'm just jump off my bed and it's like to husband i got an idea for the different design for you ladies and I can't wait to share it and I have to like play with it, see how it turn out. So it's just really cool because is the designers want to learn from all of you and see the amazing and beautiful work from all of you to share. It means a lot. It means the world to us. I'm so glad life as we'll learn uh, together, you know? All together all together we can all achieve. Nuna, hello, how are you? You are not too late. You are still here, so you are amazing. Hello, Pita, hey, how are you? Giovanna, thanks so much. Um, no, Nuna, you, I did like um, Chan for Foy from the, the three, that was same snake skin set, but I did this three ones. Like I did the yellow one, white one, and the pink purple, I don't know what you call this, probably pink and purples. It's super cute. I have a whole entire different plans doing fissioning with this, but then when I apply it with whole entire, I didn't, I didn't lay it straight. Like if you see, you see, you see it lay straight. I just lay, lay it like diagonal like this. So then it give it a different effects like that. I just trying to give it a try and see instead of straight. Like yesterday I lay it straight with the, um, Four, but this time I'm doing it like different. So this one, if this one is just yesterday live video. We have this yesterday. This one is today, and this one is yesterday. I don't know if we can get that. Okay, great. Get all of that. Okay, such a great live tutorial today. I love this design. I don't know if it's your favorite, but I think I did okay, right? Not bad. It looks so dark though. Oh, just my phone. I don't think so. No? What do I do? Okay, here. Now, I think I'm afraid of snake, but I think I'm ready to wear it on my nails. I think I can do this on my nails. Not that scared. My sister have a snake, just in case. It's funny that I, every time we FaceTime, and if you have snake, it's scared the heck of me. It's like, it's coming, but then she's have him like in her cage, so. So excited, and besides, it's um, special sales for Christmas in July. If you are checking out a lot of different products, it's gonna be automatically to get yours. Um, thank you so much, Nail Tech. Thank you, super cute bling nails. <laughs> uh, hi, Bonita, how are you? Thanks so much. I just didn't want to miss anyone. Hi, Seen Flower, thank you. All right, so thank you, Mama Vic. Um, so besides special, it's twenty five percent of uh, Christmas in July. If you seeing it's any products you purchase, will automatic twenty five percent off, and you can using special code to get your free shipping of seventy nine 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 and special gift. And also, um, if you look into the categories of Christmas in July, it's really special in there, and a lot of items that special. It looks like. It's not anything sell, but actually it's really inside. So you look in there, it's something that you were looking for, like a uh, designer chant for foy, or butterflies flower chant for foy, take a look close in there. It's gonna be really cool and fun. 
and I can't wait tomorrow we're gonna do some things really fun and I can't wait and here I want to show you some of the colors we've been waiting forever and ever and I have it all light up in my special box right here I can't wait is a tall color of a gel painting and you're already familiar with the black and white which is that we use it all the times and now you're gonna see is more colors of a gel painting I'm so thrilled I couldn't even wait like really hard for me to be patient because I don't know what it is I know what his patient is. Like, I want it now. This is funny. Just because the next one, I'm so thrilled with this color as well. There's so many that we can do with. Silver and gold. And I just want to show you quick. Pink and red. Awesome. And one more last color is yellows on the way. But I want to show what I have so then you see. And then let me see if I can get the open one of this. Look at that. How the lie of this. We can do a French skinny French. I don't know what you call that. Um, with this super precision, precise brush. So then you can do really thin French perfectly. Especially when you're doing it on the toe pedicure or like on the skinny and like French look now for the nails. So freaking stunning. And now beside ours, um, oh, beside ours, um, golden touch, this is our goal, but it's a little bit a thinner viscosity. So we can use it if you get the part to do a lot of gel painting, like painting, painting on with the brush. Or if you need this for the line doing your fusioning, marble look is amazing. It's coming with the silver as well. So, ah, so satisfying. I can't wait to swatch this with you tomorrow and some design too. Let's see with this blue. Ah, looks so pretty. I can't wait to do it. Let's see the hot pink. It's the hottest for the summertime. So beautiful. I can't wait. Now I'm hardly can't wait. What else do we have? The royal, the royal blue. Ah, it's so pretty. This is so pretty. I already have an idea what we're gonna do with our designs. And the purple, we have every colors we needed it. Ooh. I'm afraid of it's too full because I'm afraid I'm gonna drip it. Like. So I'm gonna be careful. And of course you have the red and the uh, white. I'm gonna leave it here so then we can swatch it tomorrow and then the products will be dropped for to ready to purchase by tomorrow in the morning. So I will show you another set is Weaver Gel, 40 gel. 4D gel is something that I can't wait. Another 12 colors for you to play with. Newest one. I can't wait because maybe I should, maybe I should do one of this color open. Let's see, cheeky. This is so gonna hold underneath. You wanna put it down here, maybe? Can I move this one? Here? I love this next skin collection. Let me see if I can open this. Oh, I need an editor. 
-hmm. I can't wait because we want to do something fun with this, absolutely. Remove that one. Here you go. There you go. to do. Ooh, so cool. You see that how you can do the flowers so easy? This color I'm really thrilled. We can do with um, do I have any nails? I wonder that I have one of the nails here. My orange one. Do you see that? You don't have to. No. Let's see. Let's see, you can play with this. Sorry, I can't wait. I'm just so curious, silly. But let's see. My silicone 3D brush. Right? Close this. Make sure you close it because you don't want to have the. Let me see how does that turn out with me. And Sarah was sharing with you that using some um, alcohol, you can also, or you can also using it with a little bit of water. If you're afraid of your mind using too much uh, alcohol, that it's gonna saturate your 4D. I'm gonna do it just. Sorry, I'm just playing with this. I feel like you are seeing me doing it, playing with this. You see how I just did? Well, this is not like I planning to get the right portion of it, the right beads for this, but I just using it simple right in front of you. So you can draw this. And you can continue. I can't wait to do other color too. Hey, Melanie, thanks so much for tuning in. Absolutely, sneak peek. So we keep that one there. This is really cool, cheeky. Let's see, we have, what color you wanna see? Because tomorrow we're gonna play with all these colors. Which else you wanna see? This lovers make me curious. <laughs> I gotta open this lover. It's sealed for your protections, and then so then it's all. <gasps> that is so cool. Let me wipe this off. And I was like, little kids can't wait. Me, oh, this one is gonna be cool. So flexible, so everybody can do it. What time is this now? We have some time? Yeah, about five minutes. This one, I'm gonna close it because I don't want it to let it dry. So you will see this products will be dropped for you by tomorrow. All right, so I'm gonna 
just wrote it and pick it up. I haven't used any of the um, alcohol or anything at all. You can just, it's really flexible, so you don't need a whole lot, because then you don't want them to be like saturated and melted in. And I'm just using my dot tool handy with my pistol pickers. Right away. This is really perfect for doing it kind of um, And of course, if you put greens on it, it's gonna be a leaf and it's all stuff. So it's really fun to do it too. Very cool. And then you can mold this with F40 and like have, you know, looks and tie the whole roses. So, so that's just a two color for that. I can't wait to show all of this. So, and this is curious. This is gonna be fun to doing a roses as well. So we'll open it tomorrow. I'm gonna put this one on the side. So I wanna show you something too, something new that I don't want you to miss before we end for tonight. Um, this is, of course, you're seeing our traditionals are four colors of weaver gel with black and white, of course, and then uh, golden touch and silver. But look at what we have more for you. Ta-da! This is so stunning. I can't wait. Let's see if I'm gonna open this, one of this, till without making a big mess. This is a weaver gel. So we only have six colors, so now we're gonna take the weaver gel to the next level. This might be, um, we'll have to be careful. Here. Can I run that? And it's come with so many different colors, like 12. So totally you have 16 colors for this. And look at this, it's even half lovers and spider gels. I can't wait to open this. Oh, this one is really lovely. Can you imagine it? It looks like a Tiffany blue. Oh, can I borrow that one? Borrow that one, Sun Yun? You got a minute. Okay, just one second for this. Let me see. I'm curious. Oh, looks so pretty. I'm not kidding anything. I'm just playing with you. Tomorrow, this is swatching all of this, so then you can see the beautiful colors of the Weaver Gel. We can. I can't wait. Look at that. So much color for summer. All right, everyone, it's such a great night tonight. I really appreciate every single of you. I will definitely see you tomorrow. Um, and you can always um, check out all the products at our website at glitzersessionsuch.com and email us if you have any questions, info at glitzersessionsuch. Thank you, Eric. Thank you, Nuna. <laughs> Thank you, Live Ross. Thank you, super cute bling nails. Thank you so much, everyone. Thank you, Foxy. Thank you, Zoe. Hey, Sarah. I know. Thank you so much, Sarah, for tuning in. So Thank I love you, you all. We'll see you.